Hello everybody, my name is Robert or Volt Avos, and welcome back to our fifth episode of Skyrim. Now, in this episode we are going to go to Whiterun, because if you remember in the first episode, we escaped Helgen and came here to Riverwood, and talked to Gerder, and she wanted us to go to Whiterun, talk to the Jarl, and have him send some help. Something. Now, I did get a suggestion to delve into Conjuration, so I went ahead and bought a Raise Zombie spell. Now, that only it will only work if we are raising a corpse, which we don't have, obviously. I don't really plan on making one here in the city or the town so yeah now I will be cutting it because it is a long trek to river or uh, to white run so I will see you guys when we get there well 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 what do we have here some Falmer let's uh if you know any crew sons just free him and Let's uh, see if we can give him anything. Uh, we could always give him our pickaxe. I mean, those are really easy to come by. And I doubt he has any spells. Not really much we can give him. Oh, well. Maybe he can provide for himself. I doubt he will live through it all. But, you know. One can hope. Um, I doubt I'm gonna live through this. Yep, I'm I'm done. Oh well. It was worth a shot. Trash? What a jerk. Okay, so I'm just gonna leave them be this time. I will uh doesn't concern you, citizen. See you got or I could take them by surprise. Lost <laughs> Yeah, that's not working. I'm a goner. And the city guards will just attack me in sight. <laughs> well, if they see me fighting these people. Oh well. I will see you guys in White Run. Giant! We shall slay it. Or help them slay it, anyways. Probably not best to get too close. Or as we join the uh, Skyrim space program. You handle yourself well. You could make for a decent shield, brother. Why, thank you. What is a shield, brother? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An order nope. of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Uh. Sounds like a waste of time. Well, nobody asked you. But if you, you did. think you're better than we are, go talk to Codlack White Mane. See what a warrior of true metal is like. Nah. I'll do that later. Some other day. Now, I did just realize that I saved over another file of mine's save slots. So. Unfortunately, in another game, I'm, or in another saved game, I'm going to have to make a long run through. Anyway, here we are at White Run, and the Jarl is, of course, at the other end of the city. Hooray. Oh, we'll have to be so protective of their Jarl. But, oh well. Guards. Halt! City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. But I have official business. Um. Riverwood calls Riverwood for the Jarl's aid. Too. You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach, at the top of the hill. At the other end of the city. 
Why is everything we'll always at the end of the city? We must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. <sighs> Imperials. Let's just run this way and that way. I actually like the city of White Run. This is a it's very familiar to me. I guess because I stick around here for a little while. Then again, this is, you know, the first city that you find storyline wise. So I guess familiarity isn't too uncommon. And here we are, Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace, pretty much. Let's go see if we can get help for Riverwood. Brigands I can handle, but this talk of dragons? Words gone mad, I say. So have you. What can this help me do then? Nothing? My lord, please. Hello? What's the this meaning no of this interruption? Jarl Balgruff is not receiving visitors. Well, I'm here, so he kind of is. Who's this then? Uh... Uh, Girder sent me. Riverwood is in danger. As House Carl, my job is to deal with all dangers that threaten the Jarl or his people. So you have my attention. Now explain yourself. Well, hate to say it, but a dragon has destroyed Helgen. You know about Helgen? The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Approach. Then get out of my way. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Nope. I mean... Uh... The Imperials were about to execute Ulfric Stormcloak, then the dragon attacked. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls? Against the dragon? Yes. My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... That is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Why not? Irulan, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Yeah, you best walk off. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. So I can sell it. Is another thing you could do for me. What's that? Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Your brother is a yarl. Come. Let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. I'm not asking He's you been looking into a matter related to these eyes. dragons and Use rumors and of dragons. To turn his thoughts to the wall. Your oh, isn't that nice? Listen to you. Leave me out of your what injury, if it just Trongar. fell on his head to to one arm, day? Say it with your own tongue. <laughs> oh, if only that was a quest. I'm not really a fan of Yarl Balgriff. He's, uh, not the most supportive in the Stormcloaks, uh, Baringar, I think I found uh, someone who can help you with mission, I should say. Dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. Yeah, fill me in. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me? No. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Oh yes, of course, of yes, course. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch... I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Awesome. Well, just tell me what you need me to do. You are eager to begin your adventure. Excellent. The sooner begun, the sooner done, eh? Yep. I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow. Find this tablet 
no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Well, uh... You know, speaking of that, that does sound kind of familiar, and I don't exactly know why. You know, if you've got the aptitude, Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. Yes. Seems you are a cut above the usual brutes the Jarl sends my way. Well, of course. So, what about You'll my have reward? To see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Wait for me. Farangar. He's in here. Barangar, you need to come at once. A dragon has been sighted nearby. You should come too. But what if I don't oh, want to? Where was it seen? Huh? What was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. I can stop it. Let's go. I can stop it. Send me to the front lines. Defeat it with fire and sword. Your tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the Watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irelet, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. Yeah, ceremony's I want overrated. You to go with Irelet and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. From your personal I armory? I would very much like to see this dragon. No. I can't afford to risk both of you. Well then, isn't that interesting? We get to go find a dragon. Then again, that was the whole main part in this game. But they're not extremely easy. But then again, if they were extremely easy, then what fun would it be? Who doesn't like a little bit of a challenge? I say bring on the dragon, bring it on, but we shall do that next episode. First we're going to go get a follower who we have to fight first, and oh what fun it shall be, should be just in this corner, here we go, Uthgird the Unbroken. You don't really know a woman till you have a strong drink and a fist fight with her. Interesting. Think you can go blade to blade with me? Oh, You'd be dead in six seconds. Yes. Nah, I think I could fight you. You must really love to fight. The battle is the fire that forges the strongest blades. It's an old Nord proverb. That and a true Nord never misses a chance to test her worth. Think you can take me on? And why not? I could beat anyone in this city, barehanded. A hundred gold says I knock your hide to the ground. You're on. Just fists. No weapons, no magic, no crime. Let's go. Bring it. Let's go. Well, another mess squash beneath my Bring it. She is kicking our butt. Um, 
This is actually not looking very good. Um, gods, yes. I don't want to die. Um, potions. Oh, I do have potions of healing. And I think I sold my fatigue potions. Awesome. I'm giving you all I've got. Why don't you just fall down and give up? There we go. We did it. Now that's we what did I it. call a punch. You got me. Of course. I think I've earned that 100 gold. You're no liar. Best fight I've had in years. There you are. If Thank you, you very ever much. need another blade at your side, just ask. Wouldn't mind seeing how you handle a few trolls. <laughs> trolls. <laughs> no, thank you. Trolls are a pain. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. Follow me. I need your help. Let's not waste any time. To fight a dragon. So get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Hey, watch it. Then get up. Get up. Get up. What are you doing? Get up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come here. Come here, little ooth gird. Come here. Come here. Come here. Get up. <laughs> Maybe she'll get up if we go outside. Um, I think I broke her. We've stopped. What is it? Um, wait here. I'll stand guard. So don't talk to me. Going? Follow me. Now he's gone. Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. Well then. My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, Battleborns, where is he? Where are you? Well, okay. Um, I guess since she's kind of messed up, I will see you guys later. Um, I really don't know what's wrong with her. Uh, I'll try to figure it out. And then next episode, we will take on that dragon and find out what lies next. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching thank you for watching uh, have a good day have a great day and god bless and take care